So, now that we know exactly why you guys are here, let's talk about the green stuff. CDL, a powerful three different letters. I like to use those letters to also equal ATM. Because if you guys don't already know, your CDL card is pretty much your ATM card. Notice, it's a piece of plastic where if you take care of it, it's going to keep bringing you money. If you don't take care of it, then it's only going to last you a little bit of time. What do I mean by take care of it? Once you get a CDL license, your driving record is everything that you did as a driver and it's going to follow you for the rest of your life. So if you follow our rules and if you get trained correctly, your driving record should stay spotless, which means that you are looking for a very wealthy career in becoming a professional driver. Now, what kind of career can we really obtain being a, a professional driver? Well, a professional driver, that's just the first stage that a CDL will get you to. A CDL is more than just a key to getting to be a professional driver. It's a key to many different levels of income. Now, the first one that you guys are mostly accustomed to is be a normal company driver. As a normal company driver, when you come out of school, you're going to have the choice of working in three different fields, which is local, regional, or over the road. Now, if you choose to go into a local route, these are usually Class B and Class A jobs that are available. These jobs usually pay by the hour. Now, if you have no experience, these jobs are going to pay anywhere from 16 to I've seen as high as 20 $21 an hour. Now, of course, you have no experience. Once you build up some experience, then I've seen as high as $25, $30 an hour in these kinds of jobs. These kind of jobs also, in most cases, offer overtime. So, you get best of both worlds. Now, a regional job, this is where you're home about uh, twice a week, right? So, you come home weekly, you're going about 8 to, eight to 10 hour round trip, going outside of the state. And what does this do? This makes you into a mileage paid driver if you're working for a company which means that the more miles that you drive the more you get paid an average starting salary in somebody in this category we're talking anywhere from thirty five to forty thousand dollars a year starting salary of course and then the next level up on top of that would be an over the road driver this is for those adventure seekers out there those people who want to travel the country and see this beautiful country that we have and with that then you're starting off anywhere from fifty to about sixty-five thousand dollars a year just as your starting pay. That one you also get paid by the mile, which means the more you drive, the more you get paid. So that's the first level of what a CDL can get you. The level on top of that is what we call owner operator. This is where you own your own truck, right? So you are gonna get paid a lot more, but you also have more responsibility, right? Because as a driver, you don't have to pay for things like fuel and maintenance. When you own your own truck, that's when you have to start taking responsibility for your actions and paying for your fuel, paying for any maintenance, paying for any repairs that happen to your truck. Now for that, the company is going to pay you a lot more. An average owner operator with experience or without experience, they can gross, I've seen as high as $300,000 a year which means that an average take-home salary for an owner-operator, which means you own your own truck, is anywhere from the $120,000 range to as high as $200,000, depending on what route and how much driving you're looking to do. Now this is something if you're a business-minded person and you have some money behind you to get started, you can definitely get into this higher bracket of pay. Of course, more responsibility, but more pay. Now the bracket on top of that means that you are a carrier, which means now you have many, you have two or more trucks working for you. You're the one responsible for their loads, make sure that they all have loads to go back and forth. You're the one responsible for hiring and firing these drivers and maintaining all your equipment. But with that, you can make anywhere from $100,000 a year to unlimited dollars a year. All you have to do is Start buying one, two, three, four trucks, however many trucks you want to work for, however much you're, you want your paycheck to be. You can work as hard as you want in order to get the income that you deserve. 
if you want to be in the carrier bracket. Now, if this is impossible to some of you, let me just tell you a quick story. If you guys have never heard of the company called Schneider, Schneider International uh, is actually the biggest trucking company in the U.S. right now. And they started off with one gentleman who sold his taxi cab in New York and decided to buy a tractor trailer. That gentleman is still alive today, and now that company has over 19,000 trucks. That was all done in one lifetime. If he could do it, why can't you? All needs is effort. We're here to help you along the way. Now, say you start driving and then all of a sudden you don't feel like this whole driving thing is for you. Was the CDL a waste? Well, that's no. The CDL can get you a lot of non-driving jobs as well. You can be a safety manager. You can be a dispatcher. You can even be an instructor at a school. You can even work for a larger trucking company and become one of their recruiters to make sure that that company has a constant new flow of new hires coming into that company. So there are a lot of opportunities that you can have as a CDL driver. You can start off with an hourly pay, you can go into mileage pay, you can start off with your own truck. It's pretty much up to you. The path is not written yet. So it all depends on what your goals are, whether it's stay home as often as you can, or work as hard as you can to make as much money as you can as quick as you can. All you really have to do is learn who you are on the inside and understand where you fit. We're here to help you in any way, shape, or form that we can. And that is why you have automatically been enrolled into our lifetime job placement program. Which means it's our job to help you find a job for the rest of your life. Up until the day you die. After you're dead, I can't help you anymore. Alright, so don't even try. So. I hope you guys are excited about all the opportunity that awaits you after you get a CDL. But understand this, all that opportunity only comes after you pass all these tests. So this is your day one. Time to get to work. Keep that in your mind. Thank you.